cost of health care, one group of Americans getting a grim prognosis, and it is a group that can least afford it. According to a new House committee report, when Obamacare takes full effect, young Americans will see their health care premiums skyrocket up to 203 percent. 203 percent? Well, recent college graduates paying triple their current cost. The Hills Elise V. Beck joins us. Nice to see you. Hi, Greta. Now, this study is from a number of Republicans' committees. Is that correct? That's right. And what they did is assemble the conclusions of many studies that had done, been done before by the insurance industry, by different states. And what they found is that there's going to be a range of cost increases under the health care law as the major provisions come into effect next year. And, and was this unanticipated? I don't think so. I think Republicans have been making this case for a long time. The other side of the argument is that Democrats say the law also gives a variety of benefits to people who might otherwise see their health care costs go up. So, for example, people buying uh, insurance on the individual market, which is what we're talking about right now, if their premiums go up, especially if they're young people, it's likely that they could be eligible for some kind of assistance from the government to buy that coverage. So that's that's the other side well, of the it, argument. It seems to me if, if, the, if it's going to go up 203% for some people, the young people, they're less likely to buy it. If they're less likely to buy it, they're not part of this big pool of everyone sort of pitching in money drawing down the cost. So if, if, it, if the costs go high individually, they're not going to buy it, and that's going to generate costs up for everybody else as the, as the pool gets smaller. Right. And this is exactly what the insurance industry has been telling us. Now, Republicans have floated bills over time to sort of shift some of the provisions and try to avoid these cost increases. But this is, you know, the new front line on the, the war against Obamacare. We're seeing this debate is, happen is this over a, costs. Is this a fair thing? I mean, did the Obama, is it, the Obama administration, they, did they adequately warn the American people of this type of cost increase? I mean, I think Republicans would say that Obama made a variety of claims that were not true. Now, Obama disagrees with that. But, you know, I think that uh, in the future, the law is going to be implemented no matter what. Obama won the election. And so in Congress, we're seeing committees come and try to conduct these debates over whether the law is being implemented as well as it possibly can. And that's why we're talking about costs. And well, if the cost skyrockets, also the American people aren't going to stop talking about it either. That's right. Elise, thank you. Thanks. Straight ahead.